thing for me. I, I just, I'm not in a place in my life anymore where mm -hmm. I think a reality television show like that really makes sense for me. Okay. I think that, um, I think it's really fun, and I'm definitely going to be tuning in. Will you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, for sure. I think it's totally fun. Um, but, you know, when you participate in a show like that, you generally don't have creative control over how you or your character is portrayed mm -hmm. on TV. And I am an advocate for women. I'm a feminist. I own this business supporting women's health. And so to not be able to be in control of my own narrative um, is just way too risky sure, yeah. for me at this point. Mm -hmm. And it just doesn't make sense for my audience. But. I yeah. think it's really fun that uh -huh. it's happening. Right, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do you feel that you were not portrayed in the best way then? I think, you know, as a younger person, um, reality TV was sort of new right. at that point. And mm -hmm. so there was still a lot of learning to be done. I felt like we were guinea pigs to a certain degree. and well, Like the first of its kind. Yeah, yeah. exactly. And mm -hmm. so things would happen and then I would watch the episode on TV and think, that did, that's not real. <laughs> yeah, really? Yeah, yeah, you know, there were there were a number of episodes where they pitted Audrina and I against each other, and we had no problems in real life. And I, they made me look so mean. Did I you guys thought, like oh, call gosh. each other afterwards and be like, we lived we lived in the same oh, house, right, yeah. you know? Mm -hmm. um, but the thing about reality TV is that when they um, create some type of drama on the show, it tends to then perpetuate an issue in real life. Yeah. So right. I mean, we're we're fine. And we always have been fine, but. I I've seen it with so many different people, mm -hmm. you know? So you never wanted to maybe go back on and change the narrative? No, no. I just, it, for me, like, I, it's just not worth it for me it's at this point. I'm just, I'm just too old to, to go back into the lion's den. <laughs> right, yeah, <laughs> you no, know you're like, what I'm I mean? good, I'm good. Do you still, uh, are you still in contact? anybody? Yeah, Lauren and Stephanie. Okay, nice. Yeah. 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 Have you seen Lauren at all? Seen the baby? Um, mm -hmm. Yes, this past summer. Oh, that's exciting. Yeah, that's exactly. nice. I mean, people forget that like you guys grew up together. Yeah, we did you grow know? up together. She yeah. lives in my parents' neighborhood. That's so great. Yeah, that's so, so nice. nice. Um, and Stephanie is, is so funny. Yeah, she is funny. <laughs> I love Stephanie. Yeah, I'm, I'm curious to, to see how everyone is doing. Yeah, do you have any regrets doing the show? Um, no, it has no. given me this this platform, this you know mm -hmm. opportunity to to build um, a remarkable life for myself. I think at some point, just like anybody that has been in the public eye or in the spotlight, you have to learn how to be in the public eye and in mm -hmm. the spotlight. And for me, I don't really love the attention. Okay. Other people do love the attention. For me, it's it's the opposite. Right. And so I had to kind of contend with that at a really young age. I, I know that you've said that it was hard for you after the show. Because yeah. Because people treated you differently too. Yeah, just mm -hmm. kind of trying to figure it out. But at this point, you know, I'm I'm 32. I have a good head on my shoulders. Yeah. Yeah. Whose story are you? excited to see unfold while you watch the hmm. season? Um, I'm really interested to see how Whitney is doing. Yeah. She's such a sweet she girl. Sweet. Yeah. And she has that cute baby now. Mm -hmm. So I think yeah. I'm, I'm rooting for Whitney. Definitely. <laughs> were, you, were you strongly opposed to a reunion or do you think it's a good idea? Um, I, I, I honestly have been sort of neutral about yeah. it. You know, like mm -hmm. they asked me to do it and I said no because that's just how I feel. But I think I think it's an interesting opportunity to see people come back together. I like I watched the Jersey Shore oh reunions God, love, a yeah. little bit. Uh -huh. <laughs> They're amazing. <laughs> and it's fun. Yeah. You know, you root for these people. You feel like you're a part of their or you feel like they are a part of your life. So mm -hmm. I think it's I think it's totally fun. And, you know, I wish everybody the best. And I hope that everybody um, gets some good opportunities because of it. Definitely.